the Belogradchik rocks and the Belogradchik fortress. People say nature is the best artist. While it was shaping the Belogradchik rocks, nature did its best. And the result is a unique palette of magnificent views and breathtaking panoramas. The Belogradchik rocks formed 230 million years ago in the west of the Balkan mountain. For millions of years, nature sculpted the shapeless stone, so that today we can distinguish figures of creatures, people and birds. Only part of them have names. The girl's rock, the bee stone, the eagle stone, the pine stone, Adam and Eve, the sphinx, the red stone, the schoolgirl, the convent, the nun, the horseman, the monks. Others are unknown or are waiting to be discovered. The names are the creation of rich imagination. The rock images and the legends around them have enchanted people for centuries. One of the legends says that many years ago, during the time of the Roman Empire, there was a woman's monastery on the rocks. The young and beautiful nun Valentina lived there. The word about her beauty spread in the area. During a holiday, when ordinary people were allowed to visit monasteries, the Roman patrician Antonio saw Valentina and fell in love with her. She also fell in love with him. So Antonio started visiting the monastery secretly. But when Valentina gave birth to a child, the rest of the nuns found out about their sister's sin and decided to expel her. Just when she was leaving the monastery, Antonio arrived. Then mighty thunder rumbled in the sky and the monastery collapsed. Everything around instantly turned into stone. The legend can be seen today. It's enough to look at the rock figures called the nun, the horseman and the monks. The Belogradchik rocks area is 30 kilometers long and 3 to 5 kilometers wide. At some places they reach the impressive 200 meters of height. These stone columns form a natural fortress whose potential was used for centuries. The Belogradchik fortress, also known as the Belogradchik Calais, was built by the Romans. The builders erected only two walls, on the southwest and on the northeast. During the centuries, various rulers used the Belogradchik fortress to observe, control and guard the road. The fortress consists of three yards, each of which can be defended individually. In the beginning of the 19th century, the fortress was expanded and reconstructed to fit firearms, under the guidance of French and Italian engineers. By the end of the 19th century, it lost its military importance and was adapted by the local residents for farming. Nevertheless, the Belogradchik Calais is one of the best preserved fortresses in Bulgaria. It has been renovated and adapted for public visits. In 2007, the Belogradchik rocks were nominated in the contest for the new Seven Wonders of the World and they occupied a front position. Although they did not become one of the new Seven Wonders, we can definitely say that in the heart of the West Balkan mountain, there is a natural miracle called the Belogradchik rocks, which must be seen. The Belogradchik region has proved to be an attractive tourist destination. Many comfortable hotels are available for the town's guests. The largest cave in Bulgaria is also located nearby, the Magura cave. The town was the national winner in the prestigious contest in the Eden program for an excellent tourist destination.